This is an illustration of the Forest Pneumatic Blade Tensioning System. Our standard machines and smaller machines use a screw over spring tensioning mechanism. This is a very reliable, inexpensive way to tension blades. It works well for smaller machines and smaller blades. For larger blades or very high production applications, we prefer to use a pneumatic blade tensioning system with an air cylinder. The air cylinder is controlled either by a manual or electronic solenoid valve. On this machine, it's controlled by a solenoid valve. This machine has our basic control system with a switch to control the blade tension. Switch to control the solenoid valve and hold the air cylinder. Pressure to the blade, it hits the blade tension is controlled by this pressure regulator. So by setting the pressure, 20 psi or approximately in this case, we can set the blade tension, blade force, cylinder, and therefore the tension. This system has another advantage in that we have a blade brightness detector. This device right here is a reed switch. It detects when the blade cylinder is fully stroked out. If the blade is to break, then there's no resistance to that cylinder fully stretching out. When it fully stretches out, that's a fault condition. The switch picks it up, and then the machine will shut down. Different machines have different levels of safety, but all machines will turn off the blade drive motor in the event of a blade fault, or prevent you from starting the motor in the first place if the blade is not tensioned. 